this facility is about 50 years old and uh, we've definitely outgrown it and so it's very difficult to hold a drill session, to have live competition within our practices without risking injury. Kids landing on top of each other, that kind of thing. You're going to start to see them crashing into each other and it's just, you hold your breath as a coach. I mean, it's probably some of the reasons why a lot of people quit. But like at the beginning of the year, there's always like over like a hundred kids joining wrestling and everyone's kicking each other. It was like, oh, falling all over each other. No space to do anything, but then some people quit over time and we actually have space to do stuff. It was built for 20, 25 per room. And right now you're looking at 45 to 50 in this room and over 70 in the other room. You add, you know, your 15 girls involved in wrestling, and next year that, that number is going to grow exponentially. I'm the first girl in Union history to ever place. You know, it's going to be a nice day whenever we can go to work and not fear everybody, you know, running into each other and risking injury, and it's long overdue and much needed. And a lot of credit goes to all the previous wrestlers, all the previous coaches, and it's about a continuation of the Union Nation. We just want to say thank you for believing in us and believing in our kids, believing in our coaches, and believing in our school system.